so this is a kind of like a drawing video I guess um, you can't really see you can only really see my screen my uh, computer screen but um I recently got a bamboo tablet pen right here I'm holding it up you can't see it but it allows me to draw on a tablet that's bamboo related or bamboo tablet that I get to connect to my um, PC and I or laptop I can move the pen around and control it without the mouse and uh, this uh, makes it easier to draw or whatever you want to do I guess um, I uh, learned how to or I'll rewind back in the day when I was in high school I uh, took a video game design class because that was something I wanted to do and um, we like one of the nine weeks class or parts of the class was uh taking Photoshop and to be honest like I never thought I like Photoshop but I love Photoshop now like I took that class and like that was the best part of the class actually <laughs> and found out I don't like coding for video games but um so when I got out of high school I was like I really want that tablet and to do all the things I did on there and um since I love drawing and all that so I found this bamboo tablet that was refurbished it was super cheap because they're like $120 and um so I bought it and I lost the pen like a while back but I recently bought one a uh, pen right here and so today I was like or I got it today or I got it in the mail today and it's, I was going to celebrate by drawing something so I didn't know what to draw so I went on Twitter and was just you know I was like oh I'll draw somebody I, I like on Twitter or something and um or I was just trying to get ideas I think and I saw that Heather Feather, um, she retweeted like a picture somebody drew for her or something like that. I was like, oh my god, I should totally draw her something. Now I'm not the best drawer, drawer, artist, or um, anything, but it's just something I love to do as a you know hobby like this. And so, I um one on her Facebook and a non creeper way and uh got a picture I'll show you this one right here and I was like ah oh, I'm gonna draw that and so I kinda did a little bit. Um I went to Photoshop I went I kinda did um I went into Photoshop. Now this is like I'm probably like seventy five percent done with the drawing already, but just wanted to show you. So I went in and I opened up the picture. Here's Miss Heather Feather. As you can see, my pen's not working. There it goes. And so, you know, I was like kind of wanting to trace it, I guess. So. I have these layers right here on the right side. I don't know if you can see. And um, so I traced it or I outlined it. And I kind of filled in her eyes. That was kind of the hardest part because her eyes were like different colors or different, you know. And so I colored it or outlined it, I mean. So all I did was if I take away her original picture, you see the outline. And I filled in her eyes and I kind of did the. Uh, her mouth area and some hair and so then I went in and I put a layer underneath this and put this or this is where I'm at now where it's her skin tone and kind of did all the shadows and this part it's going to get covered up anyways so that's what that looks like it's kind of freaky without the outlines but <laughs> Um, not trying to be mean, I'm just saying. Um, so yeah, that's where I'm at right now, so I was gonna finish the rest if you wanted to watch. Um, 
we could talk, I guess. And um, you can kind of see what how I do it. Uh, Photoshop wise and drawing. And yeah. And I'm sure you'll love the sound of drawing on the tablet. So as you see, I'm making lines as hair. And um, you pretty much, it's like whatever you do on the tablet. I mean, you don't, nothing's on the tablet. You pretty much have to look at the computer screen and know what you're doing. It's a, get, it takes a little getting used to, but you get used to it after a while. And then you can just freehand it. But yeah, I found ASMR a while back. Um, like a year and a half ago, and I don't know, I just got inspired by everybody that I watched. There's just so many people that inspired me to do it. And, um, yeah, here I am today making ASMR videos for you guys. I just felt like I needed to get back to the community, the awesome community that I was a part of. I've always loved um, drawing or coloring and anything artistic I love doing. In uh, high school I, was, I took uh, ceramics, which is like clay making and all that pottery. And that was pretty, that was pretty fun. I should like show you, or I should make a video of all the stuff I made. I have quite the selection. size of the pen Sorry if it's quiet, or if I'm quiet, I'm just concentrating. But yeah, I took a um, video game design class, and uh, it was like 18 week course, and uh, half of it was, it was nine weeks of video game design, and nine weeks was video game art, and the art was like, like it dealt with Photoshop and all that. That's pretty awesome. One thing I always, one thing I always, uh, like I wouldn't count myself as a good um, artist. I mean, I just love to draw. That's pretty much it. Um, But there's a, it's like crazy. I see people like, they'll draw like an outline first. Then they'll draw like this, like a line down the the face. And then a line like right here where the eyes are going to sit. And then like, they just like, they'll erase some parts. And then they'll add to it and erase it. Then add over here and then erase it. It's just crazy. 
I mean, that's what I kind of did with the outline of her face. I just kind of outlined it, erased it, kind of fine-tuned a couple things to make sure it was, you know, not, like, I guess, wrong. But, um, I, uh, came out, or, I came out the video yesterday about the Simpsons and uh, the new Lego set. Uh, if you haven't checked that out, you should totally do. It's pretty awesome. Um, they announced the new Lego set. And it has pictures on there, on the video. But, um, Um, I actually get my Lego set tomorrow of the Simpsons house and I'm gonna do a video for that and um, Today's an ASMR video not like a time-lapse. I was thinking about doing like a Do ASMR video like through the whole way through So it's relaxing and all that and then like at the very end just like you know, I'll edit it, and then, like, a little time lapse, like, just pretty much fast forward it, so you see how, all the process. I'm a, I'm a very shy person, I always have been, and uh, I hate talking to people, like, not like that, but I hate pretty much, like, speaking to people, like, public speaking, kind of, but, like, I'm even shyer, shyer, I'm even more shy than that, and, um, when it comes to that, like, just talking to people in general, that's why, I don't know, it's kind of easy for me to talk on here because I mean yes I'm talking to like 300 of you but like you're not here like I'm pretty much just talking to myself and there's a camera that, and a microphone that just happens recorded but then I get to read the comments and or the amazing comments and it's just like crazy but back to being shy and all that, I took, um, I took a speech, and it, uh, whichever one had to take it, and, well, that's crazy, but then, um, yeah, everyone had to take it. And you had to do like a how to pretty much video. That was the first speech you had to do. Or no, that was the second one. The first one was like introducing yourself. And I did how to draw. And it was just very last minute, like always. Um, how to speech of how to draw. And I actually got a grade on it, which I was surprised with. Alright, so we got the left side done. What part is this? Is this right? Oops. Don't want that.
finish the rest of this hair. And I'm gonna kind of go with like the brown, brownish area. And then put a little white in it because if you look at the original fit photo, it's kind of shining. And uh, yeah, isn't that funny? Look, that's one layer of just uh, the white circle for the shine. on the racer. I was wondering why. Alright, make the brush a little bit bigger. There it goes. So I can move the uh, skin layer and the outline layer, as you see. So this is how it is if I move it like that. So now this this whole like skin layer is above the outline, which is kind of weird because her like skin's over the eyes in this part. So we drag that down. down so now that little white spot in the eye that was just a random layer and now with the outline this looks older all right um, so let me drop this down to three so I guess I should probably talk about Heather Feather. Um, that's probably right, the reason why you clicked on the video. Um, so Heather Feather was like one of the first people that I started watching. Um, like I said, with along with like Gentle Whisk Ring and all of them, um, pretty much everybody. I watch pretty much anybody. Um, and. It's just like Heather Feather is one of the cool people because like she'll uh, she's I, I consider her a YouTuber, um, but she is one of those people that you know comments back on what you say and all that. She's even subscribed to this channel, which is crazy. Um, it's crazy when like people that like there's several people that I'm subscribed to. And I'm like, um, like they'll subscribe back to me. I'm like, what? It's crazy. It just blows my mind. It's like, um, it's like, uh, it forms a friendship that I thought that would never be there, I guess. <laughs> Hope that doesn't sound weird or depressing. If you guys um, want to see 
me do this like color somebody else um, like another ASMR artist or YouTuber um, leave a comment down below of who you think I should do or draw sounds weird um, who I should draw and I will most likely do it it depends on if I can or not I didn't think that this was going to turn out that great uh, I'm a little proud of it I'm happy with it so far done with the hair this part's the hard part because it's kind of cut off with the words Go to, you should go to twitch.tv slash my I think that's the URL and um, it's a uh, well, pretty much every ASMR person like the whole ASMR community goes there and watches him when he plays and uh, he plays scary games most of the time and uh, if you don't like scary games still like it doesn't matter because you can just stay in there and chat with people, all the ASMR buddies, and uh, yeah, it's just, you should go check it out, it's uh, pretty awesome, it's fun to talk to people that, you know, pretty much like everything you like, and uh, Vince, who is the guy that Twitch streams, uh, my Meridian, yeah, uh, he's pretty funny. Right? He is funny, and the things he does in there is pretty hilarious. Like, um, when he plays the scary games, he'll get scared. Like, a, like a jump scare will happen. And <laughs> sometimes I've said this before in the chat. I said he scares me more than the game does. Like the way he reacts. Like he'll yell. And, uh, it's just funny. But yeah, you should go totally check it out. Alright. So, that's done. I'm probably going to erase this a little area. coming out of it, not the straight flat. And if you don't know who I'm drawing, you should probably just just type in Heather Feather and it will change your world and if you haven't if you're watching me, I don't know why you're watching me and not her. Or if you if you're watching me and you haven't heard of her, I don't know what you're doing. Using the mouse sometimes, like on this part, it's probably why you hear the clicking because it's just faster. And then I'll just draw with the the pen. All right. Um. Let me see. I guess I should probably color that. I 
was thinking instead of the background that's already on here that she has, I was probably just gonna um, I was probably gonna um, do like a space background like back here. I was probably gonna draw this part down, and then I was gonna do a space background instead of this, cause I don't know how to, I don't know what that stuff is so. And plus, I love space, because space is awesome. Um, don't know much about it, but hey, who says you guys know a lot to love something? I don't really care about it's not really it doesn't really need too much detail plus I'm guessing it's like a blanket or something I don't know who cares it's just In. Wait, I think I already have to draw it. Kind of do. Let me see where it ends. Alright. Awesome color. Apparently that's blue, apparently. <laughs> like a bluish purple. Alright. Actually I'm gonna do this another layer. Just make it easier. So in case if I mess up. fix this a little bit. Color in the feeling. I said earlier the Simpsons thing. Um, that'll probably be taking me like a week, not even. I'll probably build it all tomorrow because <laughs> of my excitement. But um, I like to space my videos out, like every three days. If you haven't realized, 
that yet. Um, that's what I usually like to do. <clears throat> but, um, yeah, I'll probably, I'll probably, um, three days after this comes out, I'll probably have it out. Because I believe this will come out Friday. Hopefully, yeah. That's her hair, too. Dang it, I did not know that. Yeah, if you want to get a bamboo tablet or like, you know, pretty much look at what it is, just uh, t go on Amazon or you can go on Google and type in bamboo tablet. And um, they are pricey. Um, probably be better just to get a refurbished one. Just look at the ratings on Amazon. That's what I did. And mine's awesome. It wasn't scratched up or anything. And, uh, yeah. this layer and so it pops up underneath the, the thing that I was uh, the thing that I'm using now dang it I messed up it's too much that's about right makes it a lot faster done my friends hope you enjoyed everything so far and uh hopefully you learned something I don't know what you learned but hopefully if you didn't know anything about photoshop and I didn't say anything about photoshop I don't know what the heck I'm saying right now I'm tired
Alright guys, so I actually uh, finished at a, you know, kind of skip it ahead because my camera kept dying every five seconds or five minutes. And so, this is the picture I started out with as a thumbnail and blank page. I had the picture as reference if I needed it. I had the outlines, did the hair, some parts of the hair, I did most of the outlines. I had skin and all the hair I guess and the rest is color and finished everything in so yeah guys that is it for me today um, I hope you guys enjoyed this um, and um, yeah thank you guys for watching so much and I'll see you guys next time